Tongues and tails and unicorn darts here at the end of day two of the world match play. James Wade threw, yeah. but he pushed you, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, he, he was always going to push me. It was always going to be that, that, that game, you know, and uh, I've said in a few other interviews, um, it was a time when I needed Carl to miss that I was going to benefit from that game. And um, he, he, he missed a lot of, I'm not going to sugarcoat it, you know, he, he missed a lot of shots. So um, um, I'm happy he did. And um, I can stay here and he can go home. Well, <laughs> but you did what James Wade does best, didn't you? When he misses, uh, you hit. I don't know, I was very nervous tonight, uh, extra, extra nervous, and I, I, I don't know why I was so nervous. Um, I, in fact, I probably do, because it means a lot to me in this tournament, you know, this, this is my tournament of the year, this is what I, I look forward to in the year. Um, a lot of people look forward to the World Championships and the, the Premier League finals and stuff like that. For me, this is my, in my opinion, the, the, the number one tournament to play in, you know, because it's a re true reflection on the game and how you're playing, because it's a racer, um, the crowd are amazing. You know, this this is darts heaven for me. Well, your record here, as you say, is, is excellent. But is there anything else that makes it special? You mentioned the crowd, but you, you feel at home here, don't you? Yeah, I mean, it's it, it's a hard one, hard one for me to answer. You know, because it's it's not because of the crowd all the way that I that I play how I do, and I play with all my heart on my sleeve. It's it it's a uh, I don't know. It's just an occasion, you know. It, it, when I got here today, I walked in, and I've done it for, I, th I think I've played here 10 years. 10 years? I think it is 10 years. 10 years, yeah, well, I'm getting older, rounder. Um, every time I walk in here, I get goosebumps. And there's not another venue that does that for me, and I don't know why. I, I, if I knew that, I could I could bottle it and sell it. Um, but when I walk in here, it gives me goosebumps. It makes me feel nervous, it makes me feel uncomfortable, and it makes me feel excited, you know? And there's, there's nothing that, that, that can make me feel like that, and this venue does, and I'm, I'm lucky to be one of the participants in the tournament. Up on stage, you, you looked a bit disappointed at times. You, now you've come off and had time yeah. to reflect. Do you, do you feel like you probably played better than you think you did? Um, I know how I've been playing, and that that isn't how I've been playing. But when I hear the stats and stuff, I'm, I'm happy. You know, and I'm, I'm more than this is me happy. By the way, <laughs> um, I'm, I'm more than happy. You know, I, I, I've come for a game that I perhaps shouldn't have won. So, you know, who wouldn't be happy? Yeah. Going forward, what, what's to improve? What do you think you need to improve to, to go through against Brendan? I need to enjoy the next one. Okay. Uh, I didn't enjoy this one so much because I made myself so nervous. And I, I haven't been that nervous for a long, long time. You know, it, it was like playing darts again for the first time on, on TV. And it was, uh, I don't know, I just put myself under so much pressure. Yeah. And I, but w why? Where do you think that came from? Um, I've got a big expectance for myself okay. at this venue. And I've got a big right. expectance from the tournament. And I, I want to please the crowd here. Um, it's just just an abundance of of small things that collect and um, multiply. Um, this tournament's probably my favourite tournament, but it also crucifies me mentally and and physically. It's a uh, it's a special arena, you know. And unless you come here and you watch it and it, and you witness the, the atmosphere, the, the players, and the standard of darts here, I don't think you'll ever understand it. I really don't. In, in my opinion, I I love it. Right, before we go, at the Worlds, you give me some stick about my shoes. Mm. Now you've got a problem with my shirt. Well, you got your mum's tea towel on as a shirt. And you look like your granddad's moccasins on for a pair of shoes. So you haven't really improved yourself. Um, I promise you, if I win a tournament, which has been a long, long, long time, I'll buy some new shoes. And from looking at them, you better hope I win this tournament because they, they're terrible. Right, round two, I'm suiting up for you. Good luck, mate. Cheers. Enjoy. See you soon. Cheers. Tongues and tails, unicorn darts, keeping it sharp in the world darts. Cheers. Cheers.